So you're actually saying like a lot of people buy real estate mostly to live in it or maybe rent it out to one person or something like that. Right? Yeah. They're not looking at it. Do you think they compare it with other investment opportunities like maybe gold or equity markets or, you know, FDs? Yes, uh, they do that. But uh, the easiest options are FDs, mm -hmm. gold. And now a little bit of mutual funds that people are interested in and trying to invest in that. So uh, people generally rule out the real estate option. Also, it being it, it has a lot of hassle when you invest in real estate. You will have to get the registration done, deal yeah. with the brokers, go on the other side, ensure uh, that there are no liabilities, the due diligence is done properly. You never know, you buy a property today and you come to know that that didn't even belong to the person you bought it from. Mm. So it involves a lot of hassle into it. Mm. So as an alt, uh, as a, when a company is involved into it and when they bring out a property to you that you can invest into it, they are ensuring that you save your money or you invest your money in the right form and ensuring that there are no hassles, there are no problems. So this is one largest so part. This is very critical what you're saying because uh, if real estate is difficult to buy because it takes a lot of money to buy, that means a person in his, let's say, 20, 30, maybe 50 year professional lifespan probably buys real estate maybe once, twice, or maybe thrice, right? Uh, let's say an average Indian household. Uh, which means he doesn't have enough experience also buying real estate, right? Yes. Maybe he must have done three registrations or two registrations in his life. So there's, it's, it's so difficult to learn the skills of, uh, you know, uh, doing the legal due diligence or, or doing the negotiation or understanding, you know, what is... Simple things like carpet area versus saleable area and so many things, just understanding all that. So chances are this person is going to get a bad deal, right? And he's probably even uh, depending on his neighborhood broker. And, and most, I think most of these deals are, are broker driven and broker led, right? Yeah. Um, so yeah, I, I, I get to see how important it is for uh, everyone to have access to high quality, maybe due diligence, um, uh, skill sets or high quality if someone could just curate these assets and give it to them then it's like a tension-free kind of way to to handle it